Welcome back traders, glad you're here today. In this video, I will show you how to build a powerful and effective trading strategy with the machine learning regression trend indicator to detect trade opportunities in the market. The machine learning regression trend tool uses random sample consensus, RANSAC, to fit and extrapolate a linear model by discarding potential outliers, resulting in a more robust fit. The proposed tool can be used like a regular linear regression, providing support, resistance, as well as forecasting an estimated underlying trend. By outliers, we are referring to values deviating from the underlying trend whose influence on a fitted model is undesired. For financial prices and under the assumptions of segmented linear trends, these outliers can be caused by volatile moves and or periodic variations within an underlying trend. Adjust the allowed error numerical setting will determine how sensitive the model is to outliers, with higher values returning a more sensitive model. The blue margin displayed shows the allowed error area. RANSAC is a general approach to fitting more robust models in the presence of outliers in a dataset and as such does not limit itself to a linear regression model. To apply this indicator on the trading chart, search the keyword the Machine Learning Regression Trend Indicator by Lux Algo on the Trading View Indicator Community Scripts folder. As we can see, here is the trading indicator. Before I proceed to educate you about how this trading indicator works, I need to highlight this indicator and its purpose so you can quickly understand how it works. To do this, we need to right-click on the indicator and navigate to the Settings option. Here are the parameter settings of this indicator. Under the Input settings, there is the length. This calculates the window of the linear regression. Width. This is the linear regression channel width. Source. This input data for the linear regression calculation. Under the Ransack section, there is the minimum inliers. This is the minimum number of inliers required to return an appropriate model. Allowed error. This determines the tolerance threshold used to detect potential inliers. Auto will automatically determine the tolerance threshold and will allow the user to multiply it through the numerical input setting at the side. Fixed will use the user set value as the tolerance threshold. Maximum iterations steps. This is the maximum number of allowed iterations. This iterative approach can be summarized as follows for the case of our script. Step 1. Obtain a subset of our dataset by randomly selecting two unique samples. Step 2. Fit a linear regression to our subset. Step 3. Get the error between the value within our dataset and the fitted model at time t. If the absolute error is lower than our tolerance threshold, then that value is an inlier. Step 4. If the amount of detected inliers is greater than a user set amount, save the model. Repeat steps 1 to 4 until the set number of iterations is reached and use the model that maximizes the number of inliers. Under the style, there is the line color. Traders can modify the color settings and check or uncheck the other parameter settings under this section, which are Show Margin, Show Channel, Show Inliers, and Show Outliers. How does the Machine Learning Regression Trend Indicator work in the market? The working concept of the Machine Learning Regression Trend Indicator is for providing support resistance as well as forecasting an estimated underlying trend. To use the support and resistance of the trading indicator, traders should be watching out for trade opportunities at the upper and lower structure band of the machine learning regression trend indicator. Whenever the price trades into the upper structure band of the machine learning regression trend indicator channel, it will usually hold as resistance for the price. This will become stronger if such a market trend is in a downtrend. While in a bullish trend, it will usually lead to a counter-trend price move to the downside. Likewise, whenever the price trades into the lower structure band of the machine learning regression trend indicator channel, it will usually hold as support for the price. This will become stronger if such a market trend is in an uptrend. While in a bearish trend, it will usually lead to a counter-trend price move to the upside. The linear regression line, RANSAC, will help to market the direction of flow of the market trend, 
just like the function trend line in technical analysis. Whenever the price closes below the linear regression line ransack, it suggests the market trend is in the bearish phase. Likewise, whenever the price closes above the linear regression line ransack, it suggests the market trend is in the bullish phase. How can traders use the machine learning regression trend indicator for the continuation of a bullish market? First, traders need to watch out for a bullish market. Here is a bullish trend in this market. Next, traders need to watch out for a bearish price pullback to the lower band of the machine learning regression trend channel. A bearish pullback has occurred into the lower band of the machine learning regression trend channel. Next, traders should patiently watch out for a strong bullish price action bar from the lower band zones. Price has formed a bullish rejection from the lower band zones of the machine learning regression trend channel. Finally, traders can execute a buying position. Stop loss should be placed underneath the machine learning regression trend channel. Traders should exit the buy position whenever the price closes below the machine learning regression trend channel in the uptrend. Take profit target can be set to the linear regression line ransack above for short-term traders in a buy position entry from the lower band. Take profit target can be set to the upper band of the machine learning regression trend channel for long-term traders in a bullish position. How can traders use the machine learning regression trend indicator for the continuation of a bearish market? First, traders need to watch out for a bearish market. Here is a bearish trend in this market. Next, traders need to watch out for a bullish price pullback to the upper band of the machine learning regression trend channel. A bullish pullback has occurred into the upper band of the machine learning regression trend channel. Next, traders should patiently watch out for a strong bearish price action bar from the upper band zones. Price has formed a bearish rejection from the upper band zones of the machine learning regression trend channel. Finally, traders can execute a selling position. Stop loss should be placed above the machine learning regression trend channel. Traders should exit the sell position whenever the price closes above the machine learning regression trend channel in the downtrend. Take profit target can be set to the linear regression line ransack below for short-term traders in a sell position entry from the upper band. Take profit target can be set to the lower band of the machine learning regression trend channel for long-term traders in a bearish position. <laughs>